Hey, I'm going to What you feel and what you think when you start watching the film is that you're watching a coming of age film. Suddenly it changes and then it becomes something completely different. Film's actually about freedom. You know, it's this coming of age story about this group of young guys um, against the backdrop of Mandela's release from prison. So the, the, the country's on the cusp of, of getting its freedom, and these young guys are getting their freedom. But just when they're about to have that freedom, they turn on each other. And then the film becomes a film about greed and jealousy and betrayal. Actually what happened was I met Sikhe on the beachfront, he was a lifeguard then. And he started telling me the story about the pool in the Montfort. We started talking about how I got into life-saving, how I got into surfing, how I started swimming. And about Stembiso, who the character's composer is based on. Stembiso's story is legendary here. He single-handedly fought off the gangs and saved the pool from invasion. His story is central to the movie script. For me, it didn't work with the gangs. I didn't like the, the gangsters in me. Well, for them, unfortunately, I was the one who was taking control. We decided to run a series of workshops. We realized that the, we needed as much information as possible, and that's how we'd make the film. A workshop done by the people who lived through those situations, they had nuance and detail that you're not going to come up with as a writer. The workshop process is very useful for that guiding you, you through the, the scenes. Some of you are chosen because we believe that you've got stories that, that, that should be told and stories that we're going to help tell. What we had is we had a whole lot of little vignettes of reality stuck together, but with no story to, to combine them. We took all this raw material that had come out of these workshops and we structured it around the story of Othello. Obviously it isn't quite the story of Othello, so we gave it a bit of a, a township slant and called it Othello instead of Othello. Um, but all the characters, you know, Desi is Desdemona. Iago is kind of hard, so we just went straight for Mandla. <laughs> Mandla is a sexy guy, I must put it. Very charming, full of himself, and he knows that wherever he goes, he gets attention. In his heart, he's a lifeguard, and I think it was challenging for him to play Mandla, the guy that, that wasn't worried about saving lives. He brought something extraordinary to that character. He brought a knowledge of surfing and a knowledge of the sea that, that, that he just has within himself. He 
Sanbonani, my name is Tribilisha Thomas Kumete, and I play the character of New Year. Hey, there's a lot of things cool about my character. There's New Year, the boy, who finds out about this great thing called surfing. I also narrate the film, which means then I've also got a kind of POV of the film, like my perspective of the film. But at the same time, because we're kids, I had to as well inject a, a bit of humor. Uh, what? Ah, ah, ah. Hey, <laughs> Otello, I think, is not a man of many words. The way that he expresses himself is through the words. I think he's got a bit of a love affair. The way Jeff played the character was incredibly interesting. He's got a vulnerability about himself that's that you can't act. And in a way, he wrote the character when he, when he auditioned. And I think he made the character much more interesting. That's a good thing I turned on it. I'm getting What up? Um, Nola Zishanke, I'm playing Daisy in the movie Otello Burning. She's like a mother figure. It's her responsibility to keep the guys in check. She goes for this guy that she wants. She ends up getting him, Otello. And in many ways, Daisy's the pot of gold. You know, she's she's what causes the friction between, between Otello and Mantla. And yeah, it's what it's what lets you watch the film. It's what draws you in is that love triangle. That's that when Moose, eh? Moose, I got to Ingan. Ah, you're going Ingan, no more. Hi. Ding a good try, Lala. So I really enjoy playing her. She's very opinionated. She knows exactly what she wants. And she's not afraid to, to, to go for it. Oh, good. Yeah, Daisy. 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 You know, freedom comes with a snake, and that snake is is greed and jealousy. Surfing is an escape. Surfing is a way of, you know, you, you duck under those waves and you come up in a world where the only thing that matters is the next wave that's coming and everything else ceases to exist. I think in that way, surfing is a metaphor for freedom in, in the boys' world. I think in many ways the film is about traveling from, from one world to another. So these characters move from the world of the ocean and the world of freedom into the world of Le Montville, which which is quite cramped and claustrophobic. I think you go and watch the film and you feel like you've gone on a journey into another world. And for me, that's what filmmaking's about.
Mana dan tabah kulmang, yang mabai kulmang, yang kuli lew. Yang alfin tanda si Indonan. Mana Indonan? Yang mana Indonan? Jauh fit. Abang mang kibiri kakas lapian. Bang ati jauh orang kemas sebab semisabian naya chef. Kita ni kulu lew. Mano wenye nda wao nyenzi mangu ni mpilo yam. Aikusha ilama tegis. Yazi ni kulewa. Yabiza ni kulewa. Yabiza. Na kulu la foot. Kule. Mili tegi gas. Mpi. Sasa uta tega foot. Yes. Minangang ayiz wun kulilebo. Why not?